Rad Martinez, uh, back for another day of blogging. I, outside, outside of the cage, I just want to be known. Oh, I want to be known as being, a, you know, a, a good friend, a good person, a good, a good son, a good brother. The story that when ESPN came out, it was nice that that people got to find out what what I do, and they respect me for what I do. But I don't mind that people don't don't know what I do because I'm not doing it for them. I'm not doing it for anybody else. I'm doing it for my dad. I'm doing it for my grandfather, my grandmother. So uh, I don't even want. I don't necessarily want people to even remember me for that. I want if if I meet people, I want to be known as being someone who was respectful and, and honest and, and being just just a good good person and uh, if, if, if I can leave that legacy when I'm gone then I'll, I will be I'll be happy with that I'll be happy yeah understood understood what's some facts uh, <laughs> Uh, I'm left-handed. Um, I'm, I'm a 49er fan. I, I've been a diehard 49er fan for forever, and uh, so I, I and I, I love to watch football. And let's see what else. Uh, I love food, Mexican food and Italian food. I can I eat those all day, and uh, you know I'm 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 laid back. I, I, I can I can hang out I can hang out with anybody I'm I'm very quiet though so it t it takes a long time to to break me out of my shell but I'm kind of shy and quiet and I don't know um, there's nothing exciting about me, <laughs> sure. it's all good man yeah. this, this is coming from a guy that slams people in the head yeah, so right. I'm shy yeah. he likes long walks at the Salt Lake. <laughs> you know, yeah. all, the, all, the, all, the, all, the, all the ladies out there. I did. I did a radio <laughs> interview for for a radio show in, in Illinois, and that's what they kicked off the show with. They're like, uh, what what they say? They're like, tell us a little bit about yourself. I'm like, I don't know what to say. Like, I like long walks on the beach. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I didn't know what to say. <laughs> oh man, that's the hardest question to answer. I got my business degree in in sports management, and then uh, and then I got my master's degree in in business administration at at Clarion University. So, okay, true. Yeah. And the fighting, you were on a wrestling team when you were in college. Yeah, I uh, I was uh, I wrestled for Clarion University, and you know was I was all American, uh, won over a hundred matches in, in wrestling and. Wrestled 133. Maybe people don't know that about wow, me, okay. so I had to cut mad weight to, to wrestle 133. So I I appreciate that there's so much to the sport. There, you, there to be successful, you re, you have to be versed in in everything, and. and you know, with boxing, you gotta have good hands, gotta have good footwork. But boxing's boxing. MMA, I mean, you gotta be you gotta be good in in wrestling, Muay Thai, Jiu Jitsu, boxing. You have to be you have to be good in, in all of it. It's such a ah, it's it's such it's such a hard sport and it encompasses so much that uh, the the people that are successful, they're successful for a reason, you know, because they're they're good in in all areas and. And I appreciate that, and I respect it. That's I love. That's why I love to watch it. It's exciting to watch, especially if you get, if you see a fighter who's just excellent in in one end, like jujitsu. They get to the ground. They're phenomenal. It's it's fun to watch that stuff. Mm -hmm. I like it. Cool. Okay. So you want to knock people out? But you want to knock people out. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, that's exciting. That's what the knockout. fans love. Yeah, yeah, the fans love knockouts. But I got a spectacular submission. Yeah, there are a lot of fans I find. Uh, especially in the world of jujitsu, that appreciate a good submission. And you, and you know what the the fans are, the fans are becoming more and more educated as the years go. You know when it first started out, there was just those those knuckleheads that wanted to see blood and wanted to see knockouts. And the, the knockouts they're awesome and they make you stand jump to your feet. But you know, you know to see to see a, a, a jujitsu guy work from his back is. It's amazing to, to watch something like that, mm -hmm. and and I'm glad to see that the fans are, are becoming more and more educated as as the years go on. But 
you know, I hate to see when when a, a crowd start to boo when it's it's not so exciting. It's, I mean, it's it's strategic, and and, and people are are trying to be you use that strategy, and, and and I like to watch that. It's you know, it's not nothing really has changed with the, with my family, my routine here, and everything's been the same. Uh, it kind of exploded a little bit, especially on Facebook. Um, people recognized me on Facebook, and my my friends list went from like 400 to 1600 in about two days. And uh, and then and then you know the the interviews and more more and more people want to do the pieces. Obviously Bellator now getting a few more sponsors. So it's been it's been a little crazy like that. And uh, my routine's changed a little bit in that, uh, you know, I have an interview on this day or I have, you know, people coming to film on this day. So it's gotten a little crazy there, but it, it, has, it, hasn't, been, it hasn't been too bad. And, uh, and here in Utah, it, it hasn't been crazy at all. I've, I've only been recognized like one time since the story, in, uh, which, which I like because, you know, I, I don't like to have a, 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 the attention, so. Um, I'm kind of I'm kind of kind of glad that people don't really recognize me. So it hasn't changed a whole lot, but um, more sponsors and then and then Bellator is the is the, is the biggest thing.